All right, Rory and Paul coming for you live. Studio B. What's the B stand for? Uh, basement. There's nothing cooler than being at a party and whipping out your musical instrument. And while you're whipping things out, if you don't know how to play a musical instrument, then you uh, better know how to fake a good hand sprain. When starting a band, the instrument you choose describes a lot about who you are as a person. If you play bass guitar... Most bass players are assholes. But they come with a van and they can double as a roadie. The acoustic guitar is basically your six-string security blanket. A staple in all styles of music. Rock, country, and campfire. Electric guitar is kind of like playing acoustic guitar, except that you don't feel like you're shredding your fingers on barbed wire. Like a fat man's thighs, there's no in-between. So whichever guitar you choose, I think it's great to have a background in air guitar. Be aware that playing guitar is a lot like being a lawyer. Everyone's happy when you finally close the case. If your favorite Muppet is animal, animal. and your least favorite article of clothing is a t-shirt, you could use some of these. As a kid, I was told I was too loud, aggressive, and had no impulse control. But as an adult, I'm told I would make a great drummer. If drums are too complicated, and you don't mind thigh bruises, tambourines are making a big comeback. Can you cool your face off with your hand? Congratulations, you're a tambourine expert. Now we're at the instrument that requires no down payment and comes standard on most humans. The voice. Singing is 95% attitude. Sorry. Auto-tune. So if you're looking to take the easy way out, then uh, singing is definitely for you. There are no wrong answers when selecting a musical instrument, but no matter what you choose, rest assured that you'll be engaging in a mind-expanding experience that leads to creative fulfillment. Right. Or you could just use it to get laid. True. It's your call. True. Yeah.